What is up guys, today I'm going to be teaching you how to fix uh, edit on release not working on Project Nova. Um, so the first thing, first first thing you want to do is you want to make sure that you have tried everything with trying to fix edit on release. This includes pressing this on. You have to make sure that when you press this on you will have to restart your game. So that means you would have to exit out of Fortnite and then, you know, restart your game and then it will work. But I'm here to show you if there's absolutely no way you can fix this and you've tried everything, you start your computer and everything, I'll show you there's actually a way that you can actually get edit on release. Alright, so I just wanted to show you that my edit release actually doesn't work, so I'm going to do an edit. And if you see in the top of my keyboard, I did not press, I have to press F to confirm the edit. Same for Windows, see? I do the edit, but it doesn't release, see? So... Yeah, I'm going to be showing you with this program. So now for the actual tutorial, you're going to want to download this program called Macro Gamer right here. I'll put it in the link in the description. It's a free, it's all free and the setup is very easy. And yeah, so once you have this downloaded, you have this box right here. It says welcome. What you want to do is create new and then call it EOR for edit on release. And then after that, you have to figure out what your edit button is. So if my edit button is F, then you obviously put F. So, or if you edit with G, then you're going to have to click G. So anyways, what you want to do is that when you press start recording, you want to press on F and then wait for a second and then F again. Uh, that could depend with what your edit button key is. If your edit button is G, then you click G and then you wait and then G. So I'm going to do it really fast for you guys. Mine is F. So I'll show you. Start F, wait, F. That's it. All you have to do is press F twice. Then you're going to see this delay in the middle. You want to put that all the way down to, I'd say, start at 50. It's really just about like playing around with it and see what you're comfortable with. But I'm going to try 50 first. I'm going to press OK. Alright guys, I forgot to mention that also when you go to this binded key, you want to bind it as whatever you edit with. So I edit with F, press F, and then put these delay to 0 0.05, 0 0.05, and this one at 0 0.50. So let's, oh yeah. all right, now, as you can see, it's still like a little like slow for me. So I'm going to bump it a little bit faster because I edit a little bit more faster than that. So what do you do is stop, go back on edit, and I'm going to try 0 0.3. Go back to run, go back here. And then let's see if it's fast. All right, so I'm showing my gameplay from outside the computer. I just wanted to show you guys that it actually works. So I have it at, I don't know if you could really see there, but it says 0 0.15 delay. So I'm gonna try to run that and see if that's better for me. So this might be a little, fa a little fast for me. All right, no, it's pretty good. So yeah, it's pretty much the macros that's doing all the work. And I think it's pretty good. Yeah. So it's just a lot of practice that you're gonna do it with. But with a lot of practice, you'll be able to do it pretty well. So just practice with a wall and just, just do that, you know? <laughs> 